TV. We are here for your life, your marriage, and your family. We are Jay and Laura LaFoon, and welcome to Audio Foundry Studios in, in beautiful, beautiful downtown Elma, <laughs> Michigan. This is our second set. We are so excited that uh, all the stuff that's happening with the new studio, we just can't tell you how excited we are and how grateful we are to Bill Gilbert and his staff at Audio Foundry Studios and for all the work that we're, we're having a good time. We are having a great time. Well, you know, we get to travel a lot, and one of the things that happens when we travel is we get to experience really cool restaurants and when we were in LA they took us to a Hawaiian restaurant. I didn't know there was such a thing as Hawaiian restaurant. I mean we when were, we were in Hawaii we, and didn't, we didn't know even that we had Hawaiian a Hawaiian restaurant. Food. Yeah but this Wait, was pineapple? great. We ate pineapple <laughs> and pineapple ice cream but we went to a Hawaiian restaurant had wonderful food. One of the best things there was bacon fried rice. Bacon fried rice. I was bacon. in heaven. Anything well, is good when you add bacon to it. That's right. That's well, just we a fact ate of life. Before the <laughs> show, and when we eat before a show, we can't eat a lot because then it's like. Bleh. So we ate a little bit, and we saved the rest in the doggy bag, and we took it the doggy bag back to our hotel room, and we ate that after the show. And at three thirty in the morning, I am woken up by Laura. She is having a nightmare. She's I don't like, remember it. no, Hawaiian chicken. Going, I don't want any more bacon fried totally rice. On no, his word. Hawaiian chicken. Totally I don't want any word. more bacon fried rice. And I'm just like, what? what? Hawaiian chicken, bacon fried rice. What? 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 It's 3.30 in the morning. I'm waking up. I can't get back to sleep. I, honey, it's just a nightmare. Okay. She's gone again. But apparently, there was a Hawaiian chicken that was force feeding bacon fried rice down my wife. The Hawaiian chicken's called Jay, force feeding <laughs> bacon chicken fried rice down my throat. But anyway, hey, we have a question from one of our TV viewers this week. That's really exciting. If you are watching our TV show and you would like to ask a question that you would like answered on the TV show, you can simply ask that question at facebook.com backslash Jay and Laura LaFood. That's right. And we will answer your question right here on Jay and Laura TV. But here's the question this week. It was really short and sweet and to the point. A woman asked this, is sex all there is? And at first I kind of was like, to what? Is sex all there is to what? And I'm assuming she means is sex all there is to marriage? Or is sex all there is? Or is or this is, all there is to sex? Is sex really just Cause, that? Because <laughs> really, I'll be honest, when I got married, I was like, is, what's the big deal? I don't really get the big deal about this whole thing. But you know what? As we have done marriage education for over 16 years, and as we've grown in our relationship, we have really realized that there are five different facets to intimacy. And how do you feel and, about sex now, honey? Well, I like to have it more than just one day in June, but <laughs> still, anyway. <laughs> there are five different facets of intimacy, and one of those is the physical area, but there's also a social intimacy, a mental intimacy, an emotional intimacy, and a spiritual intimacy. And actually, we're going to start kind of talking about those here in the next couple of weeks on the TV show. So you want to stay tuned because we're going to start talking about intimacy on the TV show, not just physical intimacy. So don't check out, but we're going to talk about how to recapture that friendship, how to realize that you think differently, how to realize that you are emotionally different, and then spiritual intimacy and what that actually means to your spiritual and, and, life. And here's, here's the reality. In marriage, sex isn't the only thing. Okay, it's an important thing, but it's not the only thing. And we want to help you understand this by sharing with you an article from beauty.com. Ubeauty.com. Ubeauty.com. Ubeauty. Ubeauty. Ubeauty, baby. Ubeauty. You beauty. <laughs> anyway, share with you an article from ubeauty.com on the benefits of sex. Okay, and, and we're not trying to be crass or crude here, but there are benefits to sex. And the first is pain relief. Okay, women with chronic pain, it's reported that the more sex they have, the less pain they are in. And I believe it's because of, of the endorphins, endorphins mm -hmm. that are released. I love those endorphins. Because <laughs> endorphins are a natural opiate, so it's kind of like you're drugging yourself. But anyway, the other, another benefit is that it fights flus and colds. When you have sex, it increases the level of... I'm not going to say it right. Immunoglobin. Yeah. Immunoglobin. Immunoglobin in your system, anyway, which good, actually good stuff. Yeah, fights virus infections. Now, I've been saying this for years, that another benefit is that it cuts down on cancer. Okay, now, that, again, not trying to be crude and crass, but the more a man has sex, the less likely he will have prostate cancer because you got to keep things moving down there. And also, we've recently found this out, that um, when a man <laughs> caresses a woman's breasts, <laughs> that reduces the chance of breast cancer because it does not allow things to get 
hey, clogged up in there. Whatever, we're you just might as well try the it. Facts, okay? <laughs> it cuts down on and cancer. And the, uh, the next benefit and the last benefit that we will talk about today is that sex actually makes you look younger. And to think, I you was don't actually look a day over that, thirty. I was listening to that like Debbie Boone, um, you know, commercial about Lifestyle light up your lift. life or what it was. You know, it's non-surgical. I was like, I should do that because I'm getting kind of old. But no, now all we have sex. to do is have more sex, That's and we'll right. look younger. The more sex, think you could start I don't looking know, twenty-five Debbie again. Debbie Boone or Jay, which uh, would I rather? <laughs> Just kidding. Hey, we this is, we have been Jay and Laura. And we will always be Jay and Laura. This is Jay and Laura TV. We're here for your life, your marriage, and your family. We'll see you next week when we're going to have some special guests. Special so guests. Excited. Our first guest in the studio. See you, see you then. next week.